Let's first start by saying that according to the Albuquerque Police Department's investigation, uh, they're saying that the crash was non-preventable. Of course, that's according to the findings that was ruled by the department's fleet crash review board. This is the moment police arrived to the total car of Todd Percher. Hey. Sir? Yes. Sir, it's Sergeant Lopez. My name's Joanne. Are you okay right now? Orchard's 1966 Gold Ford Mustang demolished after Albuquerque Police Chief Harold Medina rammed into him in an unmarked black Ford APT truck. The department claiming Medina was in the line of fire when he sped up and hit him. Police deputies climbing into the passenger seat to check on Perchard's health, saying he's having trouble breathing. Roughly six minutes later, and first responders are extracting him out of the car. Down the street, Chief Medina waiting for Albuquerque Police spokesperson Gilbert Gallegos to arrive. Let's check with Gilbert. Him. So that's when I punched it to fucking get to the intersection. And I tried to meander my way through traffic. Is your car immobilized? Oh, yeah. Chief Medina recounting his story again. Uh, the individual that was facing east drew a handgun. I heard the shot go off, and he still had the handgun up. And as we tried to get across out of the line of fire, because my wife was on the passenger side, as we tried to get out of the line of fire so I could get out and try to confront the individual. Uh, as we were crossing, we struck that old car there. The older yes. model yeah, and I think, he, I, I think I tried to slow down, but I was still trying to clear the intersection to get away from the spot. And, I think and we have even more new video showing when officers arrived to the hospital with Perchard to check on his condition. We'll show you that coming up at 6. Reporting downtown Albuquerque, I'm Andres Spy for KWT Action 7 News. The investigation into the police chief's crash wrapped up last Wednesday. The city claims they are also completing a thorough internal affairs investigation to determine if Medina followed APD policy.